Hello everyone, time to grind here, and today I wanted to bring you guys some more bro Tato. Uh, obviously, we've been on our journey to beat Danger 5 with every single character. There's five more characters uh, that we haven't beaten at all, and three more characters we just need to beat on Danger 5. And we just found out that 1.0 of Bro Tato comes out in um, about a week by the time you were probably watching this video. So there's going to be even more characters for us to do, but a lot of fun stuff down uh, around the corner, so just... Trying to get as close as we can right before uh, it comes out. So what I want to do, I want to play old. I want to be an old man, right? Uh, old, obviously, just minus 25% enemy speed, so they're slower. We have harvesting starting out. The map is smaller, less enemies, um, and uh, we just lose a little bit of speed. So overall, it really shouldn't change much. What I think would be really, really cool to do is an old engineer build. Um, because if the map is smaller, I imagine that kind of helps engineering, and we haven't done engineering in a very long time. So we're going to do that. We'll turn Endless on. Oh, I forgot how small the map looks. I forgot how small the map looks here. Um, so yeah, I imagine hopefully turrets be pretty good here, right? Um, and uh, we just, we haven't had a chance, an opportunity to do engineering in a long time, right? So I'm going to gladly take this opportunity to do some engineering. Um, plus two engineering. A wrench. Let's go. Get some free landmines. I'm going to take the screwdriver. Um, yeah, I think that's fine. Um, oh, lock the explosion damage there. And this is engineering. Okay, we have an extremely great start. An extremely great start uh, to, our, to our run here. Honestly... I don't know. I don't normally do TTG guarantees because it's so hard to say. But for some reason... I want to do a TTG guarantee in this first this first run. I don't know why. It's just like I don't foresee us having any issues with old. All right, a lot of the other characters are really quirky. They have really weird limitations, real weird builds that you have to do by. This is just like I can do whatever I want, right? We're going to do engineering. Um, get a little bit of armor. More explosion damage. More engineering. Another screwdriver, right? I mean, we already... We already have two century guns and uh, two landmines from our weapons. We also have just an additional landmine, but we've already gotten so much uh, engineering, right? Uh, and obviously things like harvesting are going to be really, really important uh, just because, um, you know, uh, there are like, what, 10% less enemies or something like that. That's something we got to kind of keep in mind. And we are a little bit slower, right? Um, which doesn't matter as much because the map is smaller. We could get kind of... I don't know. I guess that could be the problem of, like, just not having a lot of room, wiggle room. I will gladly take a dangerous bunny. Um, <sighs> I guess we'll get some attack speed here because um, we were in the negatives. We'll get another wrench. Um, some, yeah, scar, some XP gain. That's pretty decent. We'll definitely lock coupon. We'll lock screwdriver, and we will lock medical turret. Because, like, I don't know. I think engineering here is incredible, right? Engineering on a small map seems so good. It is just... It does feel a little bit weird to be playing on such a small map, you know? It just looks completely different than what you would normally expect. Uh, we probably do need to worry about our defense a little bit more, right? We don't have a lot of health. We did take that one armor to begin with. But uh, it's not, not a ton, right? We definitely could do a lot better in that department. Um, three engineering. I'll take six dodge chance. And we will take a wrench. We will take a screwdriver. I should have taken coupon before all of that. I'm so dumb. Whatever. Um, so locked medical turret. Wrench. Lock this screwdriver. Holy cow. I wish there was another engineering item. Right? You have the, you have the century gun. Or you have the wrench. Right, you have the screwdriver, so the the wrench is for sentries, just base sentries that get upgraded, and you can buy all of those items, those sentries by themselves as items as well. Uh, then you have the um, the landmines that get created via the screwdrivers. You can buy screwdrivers or uh, landmines by themselves. I wish there was like, because I, I don't think there is. I wish there was like another like engineering item, and maybe there will be. I don't know. I don't know the weapons. I know there's like a beta for the Brotato 1.0 update, but. I have no reason to rush it, right? We'll wait for perfection. We're still grinding on uh, some of the classes. Don't want anything that's going to slow us down. Don't need that damage. I'm going to take more harvesting. We're still early on. We will take medical turret. We'll take the screwdriver. Um, 
I'll go ahead and take a little muscly dude. Kind of a risk. I'll take a screwdriver. Kind of a risk. Um, but I think we do need a little bit more max HP. And I mean, we are doing melee damage, right? Technically when these get attacked, when we're attacking ourselves. So just be a little bit better to help clear out people that are like directly close to us. But I mean, as of right now, our damage is totally fine, but we are on wave six. It's not gonna get hard just yet here. So we have the little bit of harvesting. We got the XP gain. I think, I think we should be a pretty okay. Especially with that medical turret there too. And I'm taking both screwdrivers and wrenches. Um, normally I would try to be a little bit more picky on what I'm getting, like only one type, but I think both are really good here. All right, and obviously we can upgrade them. Burning spreads to nearby enemies, we'll take that. We do have some fire stuff. We'll take some more harvesting. Four HP regeneration, finally got some HP regeneration. Um, wrench, let's actually, yeah, wrench. Uh, medical turret, so we have two medical turrets now. I will go ahead and fertilizer. I think that'll be worth it. And oh my gosh, the amount. I'm gonna take tree for now. Two wrenches. Dude, we are getting offered so, I mean, we're upgrading these things so fast already. Yeah, we're playing as the old character. So part of the gimmick of the old character is that um, the map is smaller, you're slower, uh, less enemies spawn. Um, and uh, not, not all too much crazy stuff. I think the, the map size is definitely one of the biggest parts. That's why we're going engineering, right? Because most everywhere on the map, I believe, you know, should be able to be shot by our sentries, which is also why I definitely uh, went for the extra trees, right? Because most of the trees are going to spawn somewhere within the range of our, of our turrets, right? And that's, uh, that's pretty swell. See, got that tree. It doesn't take us too long to go get the other trees. They're not spawning like so far away from us, you know? I mean, those spawn in like kind of different corners of the map, but a retired engineer, exactly. Get some more knockback. Um, okay, armor or dodge? I'm gonna take dodge, maybe. Wrench, wrench, <laughs> wrench. More engineering, um, more engineering. Um, duct tape will take, or will lock. I think we're gonna lock a little muscly dude as well, because less range is good for us too. Uh, because I don't think the sentries rely on that at all. I mean, like, it's like, they have to get closer, but we attack faster if you're negative range, right? So, plus the max HP. So, duct tape, little muscly dude. We already have three purple wrenches, though, on round eight. Which, that means the they're the laser turrets. So, we have free freaking laser turrets. We got decent HP regeneration. We have two health turrets as as well bunch of mines that are doing extra explosion damage this is a very good build i didn't know if, i don't know if we were at doing hordes or elites i'm not 100 percent sure um oh man but okay 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 we're struggling a little bit we're struggling a little bit i definitely want more armor uh, and dodge chance as well because the map is going to be so crowded, right? But I think that's pretty important. Um, obviously health as well, you know. But duct tape will give us one more armor because we're only at one. Hopefully we'll get some cool level ups too. Did get an item, so. Leveled up twice. Hey, pencil. Gladly take that. Um, as much as I want more dodge chance, got to go the engineering here. And I'm going to reroll this here. T uh, 10 harvesting, a little bit of a risk. We're still below wave 10 here. We have 51 harvesting. So I will take Lil Muscly Dude. I'll take duct tape. And uh, <laughs> here's a bunch of more engineering stuff. Um, we'll take the screwdriver for now. Lock that wrench. Oh my gosh, this engineering stuff is turning out great. So I think it's probably fine to have like, what? Half wrenches, half screwdrivers or something like that. Three and three. I haven't done engineering in a while, so it's like, because we have the, like, if we didn't want to focus on explosion damage, right, we, we could just only do sentry guns, but because we got that early on extra explosion damage, I think it's plenty fine to have three of those. I don't know, like, I don't know if scaling up the mines are just as good as getting new types of sentry turrets, right? 
Because when you upgrade the wrench, you get new types of sentry turrets. See, these ones are lasers. I think it, when they're legendary, they become like a flamethrower one, which is why I'm happy we also got the fire spreads, right? Um, but I think mines are going to be helpful as well. I think we want a mix of both. Because the mines are just going to like really help with crowd control, right? Very much so. Okay, a lot of money, two level ups. Reroll, we can get better than that. We can get better than that too. Nope, better than that. Um, I don't care about crit chance. I guess I'll take the speed. Reroll. Reroll. Okay, three engineering. I wasted a lot of money on those, but I got pretty decent things. So, combine that. Now this is, okay, wrench. I don't know, we're kind of going more wrench t territory here, but wrench. Ooh, adrenaline. Okay, more dodge chance. We have a chance to heal when we dodge. I always like that. Um, free extra turret. Um, I think we combine that. So now we have a... Oh, no. It's, sorry. Explosive uh, bullets. Um, okay. Well, we'll get a screwdriver. Um, oh, that is the other engineering thing. I forgot about that. Though it's, it's not really, but it's like a structured thing. Um... Yeah, I guess we lock that base wrench. So I also just checked. We're doing first one is a horde, I think, at wave 12. And then we have two elites. So the fact that we have the explosive turrets are going to be real helpful. We can get another one next wave. Because we can just combine the two purples to get another explosive. Start building up from the common. I just, I, I don't think we've talked about this a while since like the beginning of the series when we first started playing this game. But I just, I, I, once and once again, I just love, um, oh man, like we still getting pretty low though sometimes. Um, I love how this game kind of took inspiration from like auto chess games, right? With like the leveling up of your weapons, getting more of the synergy bonuses. We got two item guys. That is pretty sick. Where do you have three item boxes here? I don't know what our luck's at. I don't think we've really raised our luck at all. We've got good harvesting. But our, our luck hasn't really been a too big of a part of, uh, of the build. But we've still gotten relatively lucky getting a bunch of engineering stuff, right? Uh, range dance. So this is not good. We'll recycle that. Lemonade I'll take. Dangerous bunny I'll take. Um, definitely re-rolling this. Um, I want the max HP. Yeah, we'll do max HP over the engineering. Um, we will combine the screwdriver. Okay, this is kind of risky. Whatever. Get the wrench. Um, more landmines, more trees, screwdriver. Uh, coupon, screwdriver, explosion damage. There we go. Um, potato thrower, that's a new thing we unlocked. I think we take another little muscly dude. Yeah, I'll do that. Cool. So we have uh, two legendary wrenches, a legendary screwdriver, and uh, we're building up some of the, uh, you know, we have two commons, but I think it'll be worth it. Another explosion. I mean, especially because we just upped our explosion damage again, so getting another explosive turret is pretty good. We've been pretty good at upgrading these. Honestly, I kind of like playing on a smaller map. Like, this is, I don't know, it's a refreshing experience. Because, like, most of the other characters play, like, the exact same... Not exact same way, right? This is actually one of the more vanilla characters. But just... I don't know. You don't see the mapping change very often. I mean, I think it, like, rotates between, like, colors every run or something. But that's about it. Glad that we got even more mines as well. It's like... There's, like, a mine going off, like, almost every other second. Oh, that's nice. Uh, attack speed, range, less armor. Nope. Uh, more life steal, more enemies, less harvesting. Yeah, I think I could take that. We have a bunch of explosions. Reroll this. Reroll it again. 9% speed. Get us out of the negatives, I guess. Uh, screwdriver, screwdriver. So this is going to be an elite right here. Or sorry, a horde. Um, turret, awesome. I think we just recycle that wrench, get a better wrench. Oh, we got Tyler! 
our boy Alexa. We got his item. It is a, um, it is an engineering item. So that is going to be extremely good here. He's going to shoot out those electricity things. Let's go, let's go, let's go. There's so many mines everywhere. Oh my gosh. There's just so many turret things. I love it. Oh, and this was the horde too. This is supposed to be like extra hard. I mean, I guess we still have 30 more seconds. But overall, we're, we're doing pretty okay. Don't want to jinx it, right? But I mean, we have 48 HP. Got an okay dodge chance. Okay armor. But we have very good healing between all the he healing turrets that we have. And we're just killing. I mean, we're just murdering very well. Doing good at the murder. And I'm able to just, because I've all healing everywhere else, I can kind of just save all these consumables for when I really, really need them, you know? Um, I'll reroll this. Reroll again. 9% dodge chance I'll take. We're at 29% now. Two armor I'll take. Uh, more damage against elites and bosses. I, th I think that works. I think that works. Uh, another wrench. Another screwdriver. Um, let's see. Shoots. I don't know. We don't have much HP. Alien eyes could be good, though. Yeah, let's do that. We have a decent amount of HP. Um, let's go. Rare screwdriver there. We're going to get the uh, common screwdriver. Do we get another burning spreads to nearby enemies? Probably. It's only, what, one max HP? So, we, were, we have four legendary weapons already. I mean, if we can get our six legendary weapons early on... All that money is just going straight to items, right? We don't have to worry about upgrading our weapons anymore. Also, I can't I can't pick up the box. I mean, it'll it'll come to us, but it's just going to stay up there for the next 42 seconds here. I know, right? So sad. So sad. It would be sad if it didn't like automatically come to come to us, you know. Oh, 14 damage there. I don't know. I mean, there's still a chance. Though, I think us getting Silver Bullet, 25% more damage to the Elites. Normally, a lot of the times, uh, the problem with Elites is you're focusing them, and then you're not focusing on everyone else, and then you get overwhelmed. Well, that's not going to happen here because, I don't know, the turrets are going to just focus on everybody, you know? Like, I j I'm very confident in this run. Um, bag will take. Losing one speed's fine. I think 15 luck is, is good here. So this is going to be an elite here. Alien Eyes already did a thousand. I mean, I guess we take it again and just really focus on that. Um, should I do weird ghost? Um, could just do lucky charm here, but no. Oh, six engineering. Okay, I'll take that book. More engineering. Could chameleon here? That would... Uh, yeah, chameleon's actually a weird pick, but we'll take it. So I just got to stand still. Maybe... Maybe not against the elite here, but overall we want to be standing still. We get 20% more dodge if we stand still. We also just buffed up the engineering a tremendous amount. Stand still. He's gonna run. No, 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 no. I, t I tested it. I don't know. We got. Uh, I think. I think we'll be okay. Alien eyes is gonna. I definitely want to focus. Max HP is gonna be a huge thing. I want to focus on, um, because of uh, what's it called? I don't know. Maybe Chameleon wasn't really worth it. Ah, I guess we're on an elite. I, I shouldn't judge things based on an elite fight here. Um, oh my gosh. So like I gotta like just try to like stand still and then dodge at the last minute, right? I don't know. I don't think we're gonna be able to kill this elite. I don't know if the 25% counts, right? I really don't know. Even if I were to like stand here hitting it. Nah, let me just try to get this other item. No, I didn't even get the other item, I don't think. Whatever. Okay, another turret. We don't need boiling water. Uh, four engineering. Um, I guess get rid of that screwdriver to get that screwdriver. More trees. Another medical turret. Um, another alien eyes. We have so we have three alien eyes. We really need more max HP. So here, I think I can just stand still. Here is when I think I just stand still, especially with the alien eyes. Just going to hit everything. We get the 20% more dodge chance for standing still. I mean, our alien eyes are going to 
hit any trees that somehow aren't hit. I mean, a little bit before, we'll go collect, uh, you know, all the money. But slightly higher dodge chance, right? And that's what's that. That's why I think engineering on the old character is really good, because the map's smaller. So, like we keep saying, all these sentry guns. I'll run around and grab some stuff here. We just, yeah, definitely want to build up our max HP more than dodge or armor at any at, at this point now. I mean, because alienize is even better here than normally because hey, extra item. Um, because uh, obviously. Uh, the map's smaller, so most of these alien eyes are going to find a, a, a hit. I'm getting about 550 money to spend here. 586, let's go. Elemental HP, less enemy... Nope, not. Nah, we don't want that. We do not want... Uh, I don't even think I want that. I mean, because we're not doing too much melee. Reroll, give me some... Five engineering! Oh, baby. Okay. Um, free incendiary turret. Purple screwdriver, so all we got is one more wrench to upgrade. That's it. Um, <laughs> take another chameleon. Um, come on, give me some health here. Um, come on. More explosion damage. I can't, I can't, I can't in good faith spend 50 on a reroll. I can't in good faith spend that. So hold on a little bit longer here. The two free rerolls is helping a lot too. I think we were off. Both of those were from chests earlier. Rotato. I know. I think. I think we're getting real. We got a real good uh, old build here going. No, we're playing on main. I'm not. I'm not stressing about playing on beta. I don't normally play betas of uh of or betas of early access games unless I'm really needing content, right? But we still got plenty of stuff to do here for Brotato. Trying to make a dent. One more character beaten for Danger 5. Yeah, they're just dodge. Okay, let me go collect all this money here. Checking out pretty well here, though. Let's go. A lot of money there. Oh my gosh, that's like one of the best legendaries we could probably find. Armor, crit chance, engineering speed. We lose HP and regeneration. That's fine. That's so good. Broken mouth is great. We, we only have one HP regeneration, but that's okay. Um, don't want alloy. Um, armor and max HP. Yeah, that's fine. We don't need our speed anymore. That's really good. And we'll take padding. Build up that max HP. I mean, let, let's look at this. Freaking alien eyes. I know you guys can't see it. Has done 9,300 last wave. Now, we had a lot of them, but... 8 HP regeneration, start at half health. That's totally fine. Um, mm, oh, there's Wanderbot and another Alexa. Okay, we got to get the two collab items because they're engineer, engineering ones here. Though, yeah, I think the drone's engineering based. Yeah, the more health we get, the more those alien eyes are going to be doing. Very good build here so far. I'm just going to stand here. Because I don't think we... I think we have like 35 or 40% dodge chance. And obviously max dodge is 60. So Chameleon is not... I don't think it's hitting the 60. But I think we're getting pretty close to the max dodge we can when we stand still. And also it just works out because we're playing old and, it, you know. There's not much areas we need to go around to either, you know. I'm still going to like move around to make sure we get all the monies. But all that 8-8... A sad tomato I love. So I'm happy to have picked up Sad Tomato here, considering we just, like, nerfed all our HP regeneration right there. So run around. All the money. Money, 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 money. I think next wave is going to be an elite here. I think. More damage is attack speed. I'm going to recycle that. I don't really need that. Don't need Candle either. Um... Don't need more HP regeneration. Don't oh, let's just take the six max HP. So we'll take Tyler. We'll take Wanderbot. Um, more max HP. Yes. Um, more explosion damage. Um, and then eventually we're gonna buy. I don't know. Actually, metal detector is probably not even worth it. We're so late in the game. So okay, here we go. Can we kill this elite though? Is the question. We have two two Alexas helping out. 
We have a Wanderbot helping out. And then a million other sentry turrets and mines that we have. Even then, though, I don't know. I feel like I need to stand still and actually get hits. Before, I was just relying on my sentry turrets, but I... Yeah. I think what I do is I just let my melees hit. And then the sentry turrets and alien eyes are going to do everything else for us, right? So it looks like we are going to get a legendary here. Easy peasy mode. Yeah, because I don't know. I don't think the 25% just damage to elites and bosses. I don't think that actually applies to engineering. Because the game specifically states that the damage stat doesn't. Now that's like, just you could... I don't know, it's kind of like just framed a little bit different, but I, I don't think it, it works. But it does work for us hitting them with the hammers and screwdrivers. And I mean, we took a bunch of little muscly dudes, right? So that's obviously increasing our melee damage. I mean, I, don't even, I feel like our melee damage is pretty good. Oh, do we keep getting amazing engineering items? We got the robot arm, armor and engineering. Wow. Um, no, I'll just recycle that for the money. Uh, yeah, give me some legendaries here. That's so... I didn't even, like... Yeah, you have exoskeleton, and then you have the robot arm. Um, okay. We haven't gotten all all, uh, all all legendaries yet. We need one more purple wrench. Uh, I get a little... I don't even know. That's... Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Dude, alien eyes last wave. 20,000 damage between the three of them. Now we have four of them. Um, there it is. Legendary everything. Legendary everything. Three legendary wrenches. Three legendary uh, screwdrivers here. And another... <laughs> another alien eyes. I'm so happy. I, well, I mean, I guess it's not over yet, right? We have the boss for next wave. Also, we did turn endless mode on. So we are going to get to see how far we can take this build. Um, if we do win, which is pretty sick. And we do have a little bit of harvesting. So I think... Oh, get away from me. This is this of all things is going to be very interesting. Um, I don't know. I could see this being like one of the most new OP builds we've gotten. I, I think our record's like wave 38 or something like that. Percent damage uh, does affect the damage of alien eyes. Oh yeah, I get okay. Alien eyes, yeah, that that's for sure. Obviously not all the sentry stuff, but yeah, that makes sense about the alien eyes. Get all the money. Yeah, four alien eyes. Max HP. Yep, we'll take that. Schmoop. Um, don't need any more. I'm taking 55% less damage. I mean, the armor is definitely diminishing returns here, right? Um, three engineering. And now we can just focus on items here. Um, ooh. We have a lot of melee damage. So when we dodge an enemy's attack... That doesn't seem like a lot, actually. Normally, I would take that, but... Bloody Hand, no. No, I'm good. Um, little muscly dude. Did I miss something? Sausage? Sausage? The sausage. Oh, uh, Wanderbot. Okay, we got that. Uh, oh, this is literally the last wave. I guess we'll do coupon. I should have done that first. So this is boss wave here. Two bosses in this crowded space. We'll see if we can do it. Oh man, 14 damage. Trying to stay close to him here. So all my weapons and... All I gotta do is survive though. Obviously I don't have to kill. But I do think you get extra goodies, obviously, if we could kill. Which, uh, we're doing pretty close. I don't know if we're gonna have enough time, though. They're both about half HP. There's an item guy, at least. I'm sure we'll kill him. We just have so much armor. I'm very happy for those... The exoskeleton and the robot arm items. Yeah, they are both almost dead. I'm getting a little bit low though here. Oh, oh, I thought we, I thought we died there. Well, let's go. Let's go. We did it. Oh, the chance to burn enemies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, we did it. We beat the game. Now we're just seeing how long we can last. Critical hits. Nope. Um, nope, nope, nope. Um. 
I don't know. I think I take tractor honestly i need to keep my harvesting up as much as i possibly can because one of the things this game does in endless mode is it just starts nerfing your uh your harvesting so bad to the point where you're gonna eventually just start losing money you're gonna you know the inflation of everything is gonna get high up i always praise this endless mode right it's not about endurance right even if like our most op build ever maybe went what 40 50 minutes wave like 38 or something like that you know nothing too crazy so Glad we have a little bit of luck, too. And yeah, the reason I was so okay just losing all that damage is because that damage does not affect... It's affecting alien eyes, but it's not affecting all of our uh, sentry gun stuff in the, the slightest. What, does Bandana work with the projectiles of the sentry guns? I didn't even think about that. I was just thinking like, oh, I'm not doing range damage. I don't need Bandana. Which I think most, a lot of our sentries are explosions. Does it even work on that? Recycle that. I don't need that. Don't need that. Um, 12 max HP. Little muscly dude. Hey, we got our item. <laughs> well, we definitely want our item. Grinds. Oh, we also want the robot arm. We got to take our item. We got to take our item. Because that's also infinitely scaling a little bit late to get. <laughs> but we have alien eyes, so that's pretty sick. It works. The ricochet works really good with it. Oh. Okay, well, we'll take the robot arm or uh, lock it. We're going to fight uh, some elites. We, uh, that's awesome. We played Peglin today uh, on today's stream. We got our item in Peglin. We got our item in Brotato. We're not playing Brick Odyssey today, but if we were, we could try to get our item in that. Yeah, we're doing pretty good at killing enemies. Or elites, I mean. Yeah, that's that's one of the things. I imagine there'll be like one more Brotato video before 1.0, if I had to guess. When 1.0 comes out, I know one of the things is new elites, which will, uh, will be real cool. Along with all the new characters, items, weapons, all the fun new toys to play around with. New things, new progression things to work for. Kill the item guy. Where's the item guy? You have 10 more seconds to kill the item guy. Where, where is the item guy? Did we kill him? Where'd he go? We must have killed him. I just, I, I totally lost sight of him. More tree spawn. We'll take that. Uh, ugly tooth. That's back in negatives if we take that, but that's fine. Um, oh. I wasted a lot of money on that. Robot arm, incendiary turret, broken arm. Uh, we will lock turret. We will definitely lock little muscly dude. I don't know about alien baby. I don't think we need to make the enemies that much faster. I don't know. May, that we, I, I, don't, I don't remember what our score is. We could check if we think we broke it. But I think my high score is wave like 38 or something like that. I don't think we ever made it to wave 40. And, uh, oh, you can actually, I've never really been able to notice. You can actually see the, the leaf. It's like on the left of my head. It's so hard to see, but you can see it. It's just like this game's always so chaotic. I've never actually seen it uh, on the player model. Oh, yeah. Enemies have to be like directly in our face, though, for us to hit them with the melee weapon. Uh, since we've lowered the range so much, which is fine, because that increases attack speed on ranged wep or melee weapons. Um, so it works out. But okay, we okay. Landmines, perfect. Turret. Well, muscly dude. See, we're starting to be able to afford less and less. Glad we have those free extra rerolls. Do one more reroll. Oh! What are the chances on that? T wow. Okay. I mean, we'll save for that, even though it's not the best. I got to take my item twice. Holy crap. I don't remember. I know one of the previous Brotato videos was us playing the game until we got our item. And if I remember correctly, it took us like five or six hours to find our item. 
There's probably what, like 30, 40 legendaries in the game? Find it two times in a row? That's insane. So yeah, I know last time I kind of I kind of forgot to grab as much of the money as I could last second. Dude, I, 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 dude, I think our alien eyes, if I had to guess, I'm going to guess that my alien eyes have done 50,000 damage. Um, all of them combined for this, this wave. We'll have to see. Because I got to imagine we're taking, or we're gaining so much damage from that. We're going to gather up all these materials. Things are getting expensive. I just keep scaling up our max HP, everything like that. More HP regeneration, less lifesteal. Sure, don't want that. 12 harvesting. We're going to crawl and scrape to make sure we're still making money. So we got our item there. Um. Okay, okay. There's bandana. We'll take it. We'll learn our lesson. We'll learn our lesson. Um, I don't think we need eye surgery, though. This is going to be an elite here. I know. Oh, I forgot to look. I forgot to look at how much damn. I knew I was going to forget, too. Okay, so I think we just gotta try to stay on an enemy. Like I'm always. Oh, jeez. I don't. We could die here, though. This could be the end. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't focus on killing the elites. Maybe I shouldn't focus on that. I don't know. I have to get so close to them to do. No, no, no. Okay, yeah. Okay, I've learned my lesson. We're not killing the elites. I do think we could survive, though. We have two grinds, lucky leaves. All right. I think we'll be okay. Or if we find a third one. If we find a third one, I'm going to freak out. Because that's exactly what we need. I mean, HP. So finding all these HP things is just absolutely bonkers. Oh, well, we got low to 58 there. Oh my, we, got, we went to 43 there. Uh, more armor. Nah, we don't need that. Uh, we don't need that either. We'll get luck. So we got bandana. So let's see. Okay, okay. I did remember. 98,000 damage from the four alien eyes. And we'll take another Tyler. We got three Alexis here. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. Dude, our, I bet our alien eyes are care. I mean, like, the sentry guns are great. Don't get me wrong. But I know full well that the alien eyes are contributing... I beat a lot. I guess I could look at how much damage some of the wrenches and stuff did, but I don't know if that counts. If it counts the damage of the structures it gets created, right? I'm interested to look at the three Alexas. You know? I'm interested about that. I'm just still standing still? I mean, it's doing just fine here. For oh, maybe not. We could try to get our dodge up to the max so we can just move around without having to stand still. Because, like, for certain elites and stuff like that, we're kind of... It's not optimal, right? Not exactly optimal. Um, nope. Don't need black belt. I will take the extra luck. Don't need candle. We've turned that down several times. Got a laser turret. Gotta love laser turrets. Don't need another silver bullet. Um... There's retro missions item. More at I don't need attack speed though. A random weapon is upgraded. I don't I, I don't need all that armor. Our harvesting is still at 77, so it's still lowering our harvesting. But we're doing just fine. Also, once again, forgot to check the Alexa things. I don't know why. I always say I want to check things, and I never do. It's like every game. They're like vampires, survivors. I was like, oh, at the end of the game, I need to check that, and I never do. Also, we could die here. I'm at 14. It could be over. It could be over. Wave 27 here. Kicking our butt. We're going to die? Everything's doing so much damage. I don't even know where I am. I'm bottom right here. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. For nope, there it is. <laughs> we survived a wave 27, beating Danger 5 with old. We unlocked a, uh, just kind of a um, an uncommon here, I guess. Snail, minus 5% enemy speed, but minus 3% speed. That's interesting. That's interesting. I don't know how good of an item that is, but uh, that's, uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, and there we have it. So we are now officially 
four more characters away from beating um, all of the items or characters at least one time. And then obviously seven if you include the three that we've beaten before, but we still need to do Danger 5 and stuff like that. So uh, like I said, most likely there'll be one more normal Brotato video before 1.0 comes out. Uh, it should be coming out in around a week uh, by the time this video comes out. And that's going to come with a ton of new characters, ton of new weapons, enemies, elites. I mean, a bunch of fun, fun, fun stuff. So we're definitely going to have a lot more to be doing over the next couple of weeks and months. Um, and, uh, you know, um, hopefully be 100% in the game within the next couple of months and then trying out modded eventually as long as you guys want to keep seeing more brotato videos um so you know i hope you guys enjoyed you know if you're watching after the fact on youtube make sure you guys subscribe ring that bell like all the big boy youtubers say to be notified uh and um if uh, there's some more brotato videos they'll be on the screen right next to me uh, if you want to check out our playlist a uh, bunch of other crazy videos we got a ton uh in this series um a lot of fun videos you don't have to watch them in order and anything like that so uh yeah that's that and if you guys are gonna be grinding out some brotato especially with 1.0 coming um around soon um um, make sure or you guys have fun. Uh, and if you're going to be grinding out, I, I'm spewing a lot of words. Hope you guys have fun. See you all next time.